So good morning. It's Saturday morning. It's, I think, uh, still before 7 o'clock in the morning. I got up this morning at around 5, already did meditation, made myself some coffee and brought the dogs out for a walk, brought my coffee with me. So just a quick update. Yesterday, I, I st I, I'm still in the in-between here, on the in-between. I have to do, 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 do. And in between, just to be and find a, you know, an easier, quicker way to do or, or a different route. It's like that book that I read. There was a book, You, um, you Too, but it's like You Squared. And it's like, it, it's, it, it basically tells you, it, it inspires you into making quantum leaps and tells you that there is a way in life then rather than pushing at the same, you know, pushing, you know, going the same route one little step at a time that you can actually step away and find a different route that is like a quantum leap into your life. And so I'm still right in between that, uh, uh, right in between a breakthrough and the old way of thinking. So the old way of thinking is, oh, I have to do, I have to do, I have to do. There's so much to do. I don't have enough time to do. And the new way of thinking is in breakthrough way, you know, do what comes easiest to me, what sits well with me. But in, in the breakthrough way, you really have to find your courage and your belief in yourself and, uh, and really bring yourself forward. Uh, but then, but then when, um, by way of uh, energy expansion, or ex energy like expansion, is that a word? I think it's a word. You know, but the amount of energy that you use is far less, but the amount of quality and self that you have to put into it is far more. So it's kind of like a, a shift. It's a, it's an offset. It's less action, more... Listen, there's also action in it, but it's not like that you're putting all your efforts just in what you can give, you know, like, okay, so when you take your time and you start giving your time, then you have to give, 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 give. You're basically, it's your, what you're putting your value on is whatever you produce. And this other way of thinking, it's your value is you. And so there's less production. You just have to be, but you have to bring yourself. And so let's say with this course that I'm doing on how to build a workshop, so there's, if I'm just bringing myself in something that I already know and that comes to me naturally, then there's not a lot of doing, it's being. But then I have to uh, allow myself to bring myself forward, which, which brings a lot of, you know, I have to bring my full self front, front face forward, saying who I am and owning it. And not being afraid of saying it and owning it, that's something. So now I'm trying to think of what that is. Um, yesterday I was talking to Roi, Roi about the, the, he's, you know, running, he put together the course. And he said that I need to find some kind of system if I can put together a system. And I told him, the first thing I said is, of course, because in my mind, I've thought of many systems in the past. Um, but when I think about it as doing some kind of, of workshop with it, I don't know how to put it together in that way. So I really need to sit down and break it up and, and take a look at it and see what it is what the value is and how I can, you know, put it together in a case or under a title or under an umbrella to where I can sell it as a product and get value for value, which is also the second, uh, second point of mine is asking for money. You know, when I, when I uh, was giving services, let's say like building websites or graphic design or when I had a moving company or all sorts of things like that. When I did those things, 
it was easy because I'm selling a service. I'm selling a product. Here, I'm selling it. It's it's. It's individual value. It's like I am giving myself as a value or something, or my knowledge, my personal knowledge as value. And the product is how it touches, the, you know, the, the, the work that the, uh, that the individual that is coming to me can do with it. So it's one-on-one. -on -one. You know, there's, 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 uh, I think that that also is something that um, is one of my uh, glass ceilings is that this is, it's, it's, it's personal. It's not, it's personal. But that's where it matters the most, doesn't it? That's where uh, where each human can find relief. You know, it's each person individually. There isn't a whole here. You know, each person has their own work and their own path to go through. And so I see it as giving my gift. And so then if I am being afraid to give my gift, aren't I taking my gift away from the world when my gift was meant to be given to the world? See, when I look at it like that, it's the opposite way of looking. It's looking at I am giving this and it's not just uh, uh, should I or shouldn't I. It was my gift given to give to the world. It's, it's like my responsibility to give this gift. So when I look at it in that way, it's a completely different way of looking at it. It's not looking at it and, oh, come sign up to my course or, you know, it's the people that, that need, that, that are drawn to me are the people that have gifts to get from me and gifts that I have to give to them. It's not even my gifts. Keep on going back to that. So twin flame, twin flame. So he called me yesterday because, well, he called me yesterday. So to come on a trip with him and his, uh, and his, and his family. And at first I said, yeah, because I, I, because I miss him and I miss them. You know, I wanted to see them. And then and all my boys were there and it was Friday afternoon because today's Saturday. It was Friday afternoon and we were getting ready for, you know, Friday night meal and I still hadn't cooked and it was, it, I started feeling like pressure. It was going to be too much pressure and all my boys were home. And so I called him back and I canceled and I told him we'd meet up a different time. And then he said they were, they were going to go for a trip, you know, on the side of the mountain over there. And so sun's right in my face. And so then he uh, wrote to me that they decided to go this morning. And invited me to come. Yay. So it's around, it's probably getting close to seven now. I'm going to head home. I need to charge my phone. I need to do a load of laundry. I want to put up these videos, even if I don't type, because I have all of yesterday's videos and this video. I want to at least start uploading these ones and publish the other ones, even if I don't write all their text on them because that's what takes so long. I want to find some kind of like program that takes the videos and transcribes them straight from YouTube. So I can upload them to YouTube, send a link to a, a third party, get all the, you know, all of the text downloaded, you know, as good as it comes, that's what happens because I, I need to spend less time. Like I want it to go quicker putting up the videos. 
because I, I love doing these videos and but that part takes a long time and that's also what stops the videos like uh, like that's why I get stuck and like I have five six videos to put up so anyway I am going for a trip this morning I'm gonna go finish what I have to do and it's a little bit more than a half an hour drive there and I need to be there like at 10 so I think I'll leave out of here like at 920 something like that yay I'm excited about that that is fun Mr. Hostage Date. Okay. So I'm going to end this here. So sending you lots and lots and lots of love, and I will update about happenings. Let's see if I can get this up too. And I'm sending you lots and love. Thank you for watching me.